that. For students at Lakewood, it is time to face the consequences for skipping class to protest immigration reform. The district is enforcing stiff penalties. Eyewitness News reporter Michael Ullman talked with students and parents. He's live with their reactions in Lakewood. Micah? And Ellen, by now we've all seen the images of the many thousands of kids running in the streets here in Southern California over the past week. Some of them coming from Mayfair High here in Lakewood. Now these kids are being punished, but does the punishment fit the crime? Among the 40,000 Southland kids walking out of class in the past week, 17-year-old Danny Navarro and his three friends now enduring a five-day suspension. And we got a ticket. We got cited. We have to go to court. Cited for daytime loitering, for taking part in widespread demonstrations during school hours, protesting a proposed immigration crackdown. On Monday, Navarro and his friends walked out of class at Mayfair High in Lakewood and joined the crowd. Uh, I walked out the fast to see to see if I had locked my vehicle and I walked out to the front door of the school and uh, I went and they were still right there and I locked it and then I just continued with the march with uh, the students there. The Bellflower School District now cracking down by suspending students who walk out of class. The San Bernardino City School District doing the same. In Los Angeles, students are cited as truant by police and fined up to $250. The LA Unified School District, though, has issued no suspensions. Navarro and his friends feel their punishment is too harsh. We only miss one day. Why are you the suspended for five days and cite us? That's not right. Navarro's father says his son is simply following his lead. The entire family among the half million protesters downtown over the weekend. I don't think it's okay for him to come out of school and, and doing that. Uh, the, the, but I understand why they're doing it. You know, if you see your parents out there crying for something, you're going to go out and support them. You don't care why. Asked if he should be punished at all? Maybe some kind of, uh, you know, punishment, but just in school and not suspended for the maximum you could possibly be suspended for. Mm -hmm. The Bellflower School District refused our repeated requests for comment on this story. These kids feel that rather than being suspended, they should be made to write a paper explaining why they walked out of class, what would be another chapter in an enduring American storyline now front and center once again in the National Dialogue. Live in Lakewood, Micah Ullman reporting ABC 7 Eyewitness News.